Digital Juice's Master Slider and Trolley Dolly. Now this is easily the most heavy duty of all the video sliders I've ever used. You can see why. Clearly video professionals were in mind when designing this particular dolly system. The master slider comes in two different sizes, a 42 inch and a 66 inch, which is three and a half feet and five and a half feet respectively for you math majors. Now this heavy duty slider system was designed to support everything from DSLRs all the way to fully rigged out Ari and RED cinema cameras. All right, let's jump into these in a little bit more detail. Starting from the outside in, this is the bag that it comes in. As with all fabrics and bags that Digital Juice produces, it's very well put together and heavy duty, which is very fitting since the master slider itself is pretty hardcore. And the front has two large pockets for storing miscellaneous odds and ends. Let's crack it open. Now this is the slider unit itself. You're actually looking at two different things right here, but I'll get to that in a second. Now off to the side here, that's the trolley's brake that is used to either lock it down completely for when you're mounting it and or when you're moving the trolley. And you can also loosen it to increase or reduce drag or just open up all the way for full motion. Now I've come to find that Digital Juice has extreme attention to detail when designing their products. For example, see how you can see through this thing? That's for two reasons. One, it helps keep the weight down. It also provides better access to its mounting options. And earlier when I said you were looking at two different units, let me explain. The trolley actually comes right out of the rail system. And this trolley system is as heavy duty as you would expect it to be. And I know what you're thinking and the answer is yes. It does come with its own carrying case. Now this is perfect if you have to travel very light, you can't bring the rail system, but you still need smooth shots. You're good to go. How do I look? It's very fashionable, I know. All right, real quick, let's go over a couple of recommended accessories. And by recommended, I mean strongly recommended. Starting from here, Digital Juice's hi-hat. This will attach to the mounting plate of the slider and then you can slap on your favorite fluid head. Now while you can put the master slider on the ground for shots or you can support it with apple boxes, where it really shines on C-stands. These C-stand adapters make that possible. These mount very easily to the top of C-stands. You lock it down. It's got the ball head so you can actually move it around if you want to have an angled shot. And to make mounting even easier, it has a quick release shoe. So you mount this to the bottom of the slider and then Voila, it's that easy. Believe me when I say you do not want to try to use this with light duty light stands and screwing in directly to the light stand to the slider. It will work, yes, it'll be a bit wobbly and you're also at risk for stripping out the threads. So don't do that, invest in a pair of these, you will not be disappointed. Now last up is the slider power unit because let's face it, you can get a pretty smooth shot moving the slider by hand, but you'll be able to get a smoother, more consistent shot with a motor. Now your master slider comes with an adapter. This allows you to connect the slider power unit directly to your master slider. So using the adapter plate, along with the nuts and bolts included, slap this onto the slider and you're in business. Pro tip, if you've got this thing cranked to 10 and it's not budging, check the trolley brake, it's probably on. I am speaking from experience. All right, enough talk about specs and features. Let's see it in action.